the one thing that narcissists will always do when you are away. I extend a warm welcome to each of you who has dropped by. If it weren't for your support, I wouldn't have a channel. I appreciate it a lot. Also, please subscribe to this channel and enable notifications to ensure that you don't miss any of the new uploads. Okay, so let's begin. To what end do narcissists engage in dishonest behavior? Narcissists value secrecy because it gives them the ability to manipulate and control their surroundings. But if we're talking about secrets, there's one that sticks out from the rest since it affects everyone directly. They consistently use the same excuse, which is that they need narcissistic supplies. There's one more thing that would make them even more enthusiastic, and they'd be thrilled to give it a shot at least once, twice, or who knows how many times. But what is that? Perhaps you're right in your assumption. Narcissists have the most well-guarded dating secrets, since they are chronic liars and cheaters. This is what gives them an inflated sense of superiority, especially if they are never detected. Before getting into the specifics though, here are a few of the reasons why narcissists still cheat on their partners, even when they have everything they could want. This is because narcissists, even in an ideal situation, would become restless and bored if they were idle. In the end, there can be no fire if there is no fuel for strife. Understanding their cheating habits, their reactions when caught, and the people they are most likely to have affairs with is essential. Bear in mind that cheating on a partner or spouse entails more than just physically having sex with someone else. It also requires emotionally betraying them. And in my opinion, all narcissists eventually cheat on their partners, whether emotionally or physically. Let's investigate this situation in more detail. Narcissists, first and foremost, have no empathy for others, which is why they deceive. After you've left their employ, they'll treat you like a ghost. Narcissists can easily ignore you, use you, and then toss you aside once you're no longer useful to them. To them, it's no big deal to take your money and pretend they were never in your life. Furthermore, narcissists tend to be dishonest. Therefore, this should not be shocking. Narcissists' covetous natures are a major contributor to their tendency toward adultery. Therefore, even if things seem to be going well between you and them, they will still hunt for a method to acquire something more from others that you cannot provide. These people believe they are entitled to whatever they can get their hands on, regardless of how much they already have. Also, they may be sick of maintaining a cordial relationship with you. As a result, individuals have trouble focusing on a single thought or feeling for any length of time and are also unable to hone in on still water. Basically, they're struggling with internal tensions. They become bored because there are no longer any challenges to conquer in your relationship with them. They get tired of the same person every time they see them. Narcissists can increase their supply while keeping themselves busy by actively seeking out and securing new sources of supply. In this respect, the narcissist's supply of choice may come as a surprise to you. It's highly unlikely that the narcissist is currently eyeing somebody more desirable than yourself. One possibility is that you will discover that the other person in the affair is not superior to you in any way. Someone who has a better relationship with you than they have with this other person could make you wonder why they would cheat on you with them. Exactly why do they have to decrease their standards? The narcissist is the only one who matters, not you or your current relationship. Therefore, you will not fully understand the scenario, regardless of your thoughts. For a second cause, narcissists tend to fixate on the things they don't have. In their envy, they can't manage to enjoy even the smallest of pleasures. They will treat anyone, including a former lover, as though they still own them. That's why many narcissists have sex with their ex-spouses. They can't help but feel a deep sense of entitlement toward them. Narcissists will not only lie to and dump their current partners in favor of getting back together with an ex. Narcissists are so convinced of their own entitlement that they would pursue those who are already married or in committed relationships. It's not credible when a narcissist claims they're just hanging out with the boys or girls because that doesn't rule out the possibility that they're actively seeking attention from the other sex. Narcissists' intentions are never clear. Watch how narcissists radically shift when they cheat on a partner or even just consider it. You may find that they pay more attention to their appearance than usual. 
It's also not uncommon for them to try breaking up with you so they can have sexual relations with someone else. Then, in an effort to win your trust back, they'll say they're sorry about everything and promise they won't do it again. They take these measures so that, should they be discovered, they will have a solid defense ready to go. In truth, this happened rather frequently. They were able to take advantage of an infidelity situation with confidence because they could easily justify their conduct. The objective was to find a silver lining in what was otherwise a dismal situation. My third and final point is that when confronted, a narcissist would typically try to rationalize their behavior. Narcissists have a hard time distinguishing between what they did that was not awful and who they really are. Narcissists will try to alter the truth or leave out crucial details in order to justify their actions. Instead of admitting to cheating, they can say that they were entangled in a bad circumstance because of you. They made a choice not to acknowledge to cheating or sexual activity with another individual. They become furious when you call them out as dishonest people because they take offense to the idea of being exposed as such. They would rather manipulate us into accepting or tolerating them than face us with the results of their poor decision-making. Blaming us is a typical technique. When someone cheats on you and then places the blame on you, it's the ultimate betrayal. They'll say you don't care about them or don't show them enough interest. Keep in mind that the narcissist's reasons for cheating are usually unrelated to the couple's true problems. They are always on the lookout for fresh resources since they are greedy and often bored. As a result, this is never your fault or a sign of your lack of worth in the relationship. I'm sorry to say that the video is all I have for you today. Don't hesitate to let us know your thoughts by posting a comment below. Thank you so much for taking the time to view this. We'd appreciate it if you'd subscribe and turn on the bell so we can let you know when we upload new videos. Thanks.